Hello, in this video I'm going to show you a program called Unchecky. When you install programs, if you don't uncheck the checkboxes, a lot of times you'll install a bunch of junkware. And it says Unchecky aims to keep potentially unwanted programs out of your computer. And I'm going to click the download button here. And this is the first time I've actually checked this program out myself. So we're going to see what it does here. I just went to unchecky.com to get this. Okay, and it says it's finished and it's up and running. So now, let's go to CNET. It's been a while, but if I remember right, I'm going to type in views. If I remember right, they had a lot of different junk we're included in the installation we're going to see if this works and here it is here so I'm going to go ahead and click the download now button and now it's telling me to download this it's going to take me to a third party website which is the views website so I'm just going to go ahead and click continue to download I'm going to save the file now I'm going to go ahead and run it. And I'm going to click agree. And here's where it should have done this already. Install includes the views toolbar extensions by Spigot. That should not be checked right there. So if I went to custom install, I can uncheck, make Yahoo my default browser, make Yahoo my home page install fuse toolbar and as you can see right here it did not work so I'm already kinda of disappointed in this program and I'm gonna make sure this box is unchecked I do not want PC cleaner installed and you have to be really careful make sure you watch for these check boxes then because unchecky definitely isn't gonna do it I'm going to click continue. So Views is installed now. And to be honest with you, I wasn't really too impressed with Unchecky. Maybe I missed something there? I don't know. But it sure didn't uncheck the boxes like I thought it was going to. And it says the service is up and running and no check boxes were unchecked so far. And we saw the check boxes. There's settings here, but there's not really much to settings. You can go to advanced settings not really a whole lot to that either and I would say that if you actually do use this program still be careful and still make sure them boxes are unchecked we just saw it didn't uncheck not one box that it should have when installing views thank you for watching have a great day